Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poodle, and we are back. Let's play Grandia on the Sony PlayStation. The last time we came down into J Base and went to the secret passage that General Ball went through, and well, it doesn't say right here, but it's something like a train station or abandoned train ruins or something like that. And it's all the cars and whatnot down here, train cars. So today we're going to go into this third area. Hopefully, that's where General Ball is. If not, well, we'll fight more of the various wildlife scenery down here who aren't really that bad it's just you can't I, I just don't see them very much until I you know actually am on them but if we have to fight them today we'll probably just cut them out since we've already seen them all yeah it looks like we have to fight them okay I'll try to avoid them if I can but it's probably not likely I am going to try to rotate the camera every once in a while here just to have a acceptable view of where I'm going. Let's just go up here. There you go. That's the good stuff. I did go back and clear out the other enemies at the that we walked past last episode because I figured we'd be fighting Bell, and I figured, hey, might as well get a little extra experience out of these guys. But then I didn't realize that these guys would be here, ready to throw down. Luckily, they seem to just kind of ignore me for the moment, so that's fine. And let's see. There's the way up. I want to see if there's anything else over here. Just some cash. Uh, screw it. We can have one battle with these chumps in here. I would just cut out the battles just by, you know, like stopping the recording and then doing it that way for like Blazy or whatever. But it doesn't work that well on the. What is it? Uh, Elgato or Game Capture or whatever it is I have here. Like on PC with uh, the recorder I use, Action, that actually works out pretty good because that will. That actually, that actually has a pause button. But for this one, if I press the stop button, sometimes it'll. Well, actually, always, it will stop like two seconds before I press the stop button. That's why sometimes when I say, oh, hang on a second, uh, it'll cut off and it'll, and it'll be like, hang on, hang on a. And then it'll just kind of cut off some of the stuff for some reason. Crackling should be good on these guys, I think. Yeah, I don't know why, but it... I guess it just has a slight delay because it's USB. Whereas with the PC recording, it's directly off the... Everything's on the computer already. Yeah. The hard drive that I had... Or not the hard drive. The recorder that I had for a while was at the... HD 60 Pro or whatever it was. Not this one, but the one that I had prior to it. That one was actually pretty good because it was lag free, but I think I got a defective model since it kept freezing. That's why I switched over this one, which still does the same good, same job, so it's good. Like the other one though, it had such little lag that I could actually play the games on my computer monitor instead of having to look at the, the TV monitor, so that was actually nice. But, oh well. It just kept screwing up, so I said, yeah, screw it, and bought this. Which has not given me any problems. I do wish I would add a pause button, but eh, oh well. You can't have everything. Okay, over there is just you. Over there is just you. Screw it. I don't think there's that many enemies. We'll fight them all. Tough. Deal with it. I will. By the way, uh, I checked out a couple things. Like, uh, let's see, in between episodes when I was fighting those guys, I had Liete use Crackling, and then I think it was Justin use Crackle, and Fina use Burn, since they have their various spells, just to see how the various single target work. And the single target seems to get as much experience as the multi target, it just takes longer. So let's just go do that. Magic Art gave, I think, 16 or 20 experience, so it seems to give a pretty good amount of experience for Elite there, but then again, it takes a little while to go off, unfortunately, but whatever. Uh, let's go with a... I just realized you don't actually have a pure level 3 fire spell, Liete. Huh. Bird Flame should be able to cover these guys. Yeah, I wonder. Actually, I should, I should probably check to see if she does get a level three fire spell. She probably does. I just haven't got it yet. 
And if she does, that'll be our priority. Wrap. Let's go with a another burnt flame. Hundred million degrees. Take that. Bye bye. Or you have just enough HP left to survive with three HP. Good job. We're proud of you. Uh, you guys just calm down there. You don't need to attack. Goodbye. <laughs> Pretty easy. And eh, acceptable experience. Lete got. Actually, Lete and Rap both got a decent amount. Yeah, let me see how much. It's, let me see. Let me see if she actually does get a level three fire spell. And we just haven't got it yet. That's probably what it is. I mean, it's supposed to be like extra magical and all that good stuff. So yeah, she'll be getting it. Okay, yeah, she gets a uh, twenty-five, which is fire burner. It's single target. Eh, it's not great, but it's there. And then lightning at twenty-three and twenty-four is apparently something unique to her. Yeah, fire 23, wind 24, so that'd be lightning. Okay, looks like she gets that by herself. And then all your other stuff is gotten. Nobody else needs anything, I don't think. Okay, cool. What is your current fire? 22, so you still need a few more. Uh, I think we have enough for your... Yeah, we just need the fire up, and then we get whatever that fire spell is. And you only need 50 points. Okay, so we'll be concentrating on your fire then. Okay, up here is the hyena dudes. And it looks like this might be where the boss is going to be. Yeah, probably. We got a stash and everything. Blue potion. Yeah, let's just take it. Stash. Is there anything I want to stash away here? I don't think so, actually. I think we're mostly good. Cactus helm. I don't remember where I got that from, but I don't think we need it. Thunder arrow. I don't remember where we got some of this stuff, actually. Like, I don't recall the Thunder Arrow or the Counter Ring, really, but, yeah, we don't need it. Poison Knife, hold on to that just in case. Wrecking Axe, I'm going to put that away. That way, if I tell them to just auto-attack, Rap will actually just auto-attack instead of using that forever. Mage Lips, that gives action level. Nail Polish, Pope Hat. I don't think we need the Pope Hat. Okay, cool. If I had realized there was a save point right here, I probably would not have ran back to the other save point and saved over there and recovered, but eh, I did. Whatever. Yeah, so we're here in the railway ruins, I guess. Gaia Ovar Ovarian Chamber. Ball, stop right there. Guy will not be revived. You again, boy. You're too late. As we speak, the great power of Andrew will revive itself thanks to your spirit stone. Can you not feel the breath of Gaia? <laughs> As we speak, our roots are growing everywhere on the earth. You'll destroy yourself too. Stop it. Stop Gaia now. No one. No one. No one can stop me now. We shall feed on all life. What the? What is he talking about? He's that one with the will of Gaia. His unlimited greed has been the true cause of Gaia's revival. Haha. <laughs> so, the Akarian is here too. Yeah? Do you think to trap me again? Haha. <laughs> Impossible. This time I'll eat you. Now. 
Never. Guy will be stopped. And that's quite the upgrade you got there, Ball. With the dragon arms and stuff. But somehow I don't think you're going to be terribly dangerous. Did I tell you, you need more HP, you know that? Okay, so let's see. 6,000 HP, that's not too shabby. Okay, let's go with... Let's go with Fire Burner, because why not? So you have G Tentacle, Ball... Oh, Gaia Tentacle, okay. Yeah, let's get the Gaia Tentacle there. Justin, you go with a... Gadzap on Ball there. Come on back for more! Eventually, Liette will get her turn, and we'll fire up and see if we can not give her some experience here. Maybe we'll be able to use whatever her spell is. Nice. Fina, you're taking your turn first, I guess. Very well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume that this would not one-hit KO Ball here, which is fine. I have. I have no problem with that. Let's see, let's go with a... Yeah, let's just go with a house slash. That should hopefully do decent damage. Oh, wind twist like a tornado. Leite, how are you asleep? No, seriously, like, why is Leite asleep? I kind of need you awake so I can actually attack. That'd be great. I can't go on. Do you have something against this chick or what? Come on, guy. Why are you attacking her? I kind of need her for various reasons. Who has my revival spell? Or revival item? Now, you don't have revive, do you? Let's see... Okay, you have Resurrect. Okay, good. There you go. And he really has it out for Elete. He's just not big on keeping her alive for whatever reason. Rap, go ahead with a... Let's see. You should have an all heal somewhere, right? No, you don't. You have the basic heals. Oh, you have all heal. All heal plus. Eh, we'll just wait for you. Uh, you just go with the regular attack, then. He's actually putting up a decent fight. Good for you. But let me get Leite some uh, action there, and then he can kill me after she gets her spell here. That'd be great. Actually, our, our health is actually not too shabby. I thought it was a little lower than what it is, but you know, that, resurrect re that Resurrect restored her to full health, so it's not too shabby. Now you'll be okay. Okay, that guy thing does a decent amount of damage, but the big thing is it just kind of tosses everyone to the side, and then he chooses one person to pick on with that extra attack, it seems like. Okay, so let's go with, for Justin, let's go with a... Yeah, let's go with the Thor cut. Yeah, let's get that uh, guy tentacle, since that seems to be doing a decent amount of, hey, screw you. Okay, that might have canceled it. I can't tell. No, it's still going. Gaia Strike. Okay, let's go with a... See if a Knife Pearl will get it. Here goes. No, it does not seem like it. Okay. Let's try... Neo Demon Ball. Extra expensive, but hopefully does decent damage. Let's go with a... Let's go with a Burn Flame. Oh, raging Probably not going to get your 50x fire experience here. just with this. But hey, but hey, we might as well use it just to get the numbers up. Yeah, that didn't do a whole lot. Try this, Howler!
That did way more, actually. Very nice. Okay, Justin, you appear to be semi-confused, but you know what? I think you have it in you to pop a... All heal on everybody just for shits and giggles. They're there. I'm assuming he's confused. I think that's what those little bubbles are, but I can't. I can't be 100% sure. Okay, Fina, let's go with a. We could block his moves, but I'm not sure how well that would actually work. Hoist heal. Yeah, let's try that on Guy Tentacle. See if that actually affects it. I'm assuming that healed him, but it looked like it did damage, actually. And if you're going to spell heal for, you know, like, healing, H-E-E-L, that's the bottom of your foot. That's not restoring health. It, it, just a small word there, game. But, okay. At least poison, that's what that is. I didn't see that mushroom under Justin's head. Okay. I got it, I got it. Uh, you have... I'm actually curious. Will poison actually work on this guy? Probably not, but I want to see. And apparently, we canceled Fina's attack. I'm going to assume this is going to miss. Yeah, I think that little... Yeah, I think that little... Shiny... Thing that just happened there was basically saying, Hey, you can't poison this guy. Which makes sense, he's a boss. Uh, let's go with some... Magic Arse is that will give pretty decent experience there. Uh, yeah, let's pop it on the tentacle there. Because the tentacle seems like he's the more dangerous of the two. Go, go, magical art. Here you go. And this thing actually does pretty decent damage, too. Yeah, 600 damage, that's pretty nice. Fina, let's go with a... Let's go with a life tree. That way we can cure everybody's health and uh, whatever that skull on Liete is and the poison and all that other good stuff. It's probably a little overkill for someone like uh, Fina or Rap at the moment since they seem to be pretty high on their health. But hey, better safe than sorry, I'm assuming. Okay, let's go with a... Yeah, let's go with the Baboon. That should work. Oh, spirits of green, bring the sparkling blessings of the tree of life. And yes, yeah, a pretty long animation and it's expensive, but as far as I can tell, it cures all status effects, it Bust returns your your lowered stats back to normal. I don't think it revives, but other than that, I think it does everything else. Here, let's go with a Heaven and Earth cut, just to see how much it does. Probably a nice chunk. Prepare yourself. This is it. Wah! Probably more than a nine. Probably more than the nine 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 of end of the world. Yeah, actually only slightly over it, but still. And this damn guy a strike. Oh, that, that, I thought that was the one where it was gonna shoot tentacles out of the ground and actually be dangerous. But no, that's actually not too worrisome there. Okay, let's go with a. Go with the cracklings. I want to see how much this would do to him. Resistance is futile. <laughs> right, it looks like that just healed him again. I, but I couldn't tell. It looks like it. It looks like those are actually doing like kind of damage to him. I don't think it is, but it just looks like it just because I would think that the. I would think that the. Number for healing would be like green or something, because I think isn't that what it is for us? Or at least that's what it usually is in auto games. It's like a different color. Like white would be attack, yellow would be 
something, and then green or blue would be healing. Red might be like critical or something like that. Okay, let's go with a... See if we can't get his defense down. Again, he might be immune to it, but I'm not sure. Okay, that, that'll work. Yeah, we got Earth level out of it, very nice. So it looks like he's just immune to status effects, not stat downs. Go. Actually, that seems to be the case mostly for the bosses so far, I think. That still didn't get you your fire level up. You know, I'm not asking for a whole lot here, dude. Uh, okay, yeah, let's work on the guy tentacle here. Uh, let's go with that. Burn Flare. You go with a defend for the moment. I do want to get her skill, whatever it is. I just got to actually get the level up. Blaze brightly, oh flame! That really looks like it's doing damage, but I can't tell. It's not making like the orrit sound that you get for healing, and it's not making like any like little shivering when you get attacked like that. I don't know. Let's go with a mid-air cut. Uh, the tentacle there. Okay, Fina, you need to heal up. I don't think we need... Yeah, we don't need any status effects. We just need healing. And I think you have... Yeah, all healer, so let's do that. Wrap, you go against... Ball here. I want to save the tentacle for just a second here. I want to see if maybe... Burnt Flame will get the extra little bit of... Experience necessary here. will be okay. So it's just sort of hitting two targets, but I think the the magic drawing does give slightly more experience for a single target, anyways. Bring your fury here. Well, we should be close, I think. I probably should have just fought the dudes outside and got it out there and close. Okay, that's unique. That doesn't sound like a very damaging attack. That sounds like a status effect attack, though. Okay, uh, Justin... Kill the tentacle. Okay, tentacle's gone. And apparently it's... This is the whole boss? Dang it, I was hoping it was... I was hoping it would be one of those ones where you could... Kill both parts. Yeah, we won, Not just guys. one. Oh, well. A lot of experience, a lot of gold, very nice. And a lot of experience for you guys to fire for... The anti I think that's the only thing you did. Let's see. Weapon for a wrap. And a little bit of explodey stuff. That's actually not too shabby. Okay, so everyone got pretty decent stuff there. And Justin got a lot just from doing his various weapon skills. So, very nice. Then again, I was hoping to check out your skill there, we have to tell you, but... <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, well. This is what it's like to exceed human existence. B -b Ball! You! I can hear the great will. I'll devour it all, the world, everything! Oh Gaia, grant your boundless power to me! Become one with me! The time has come. Finally, the time of revival has come. Sister! Everyone! 
Run, run, hurry! Why do you still resist? You should resign yourselves to your fate. It was you who gave rise to Gaia. If the greed of man gave rise to me, then ruination itself is your desire. Come, look! This is the form of your new god! Corporal Fina, your order is effective immediately. What? Corporal Fina? Wait a minute, you must be joking. No ma'am, as of today we all have strict orders to treat you as corporal. Colonel Mullen has briefed us on the details. Have, how did you heard, ma'am? Uh, actually, we didn't hear anything except for General Ball going crazy. And also, we finally saw what that... Uh, what is it? Uh, in the intro scene before you press start on like the first disc or whatever where they have the little video, we saw what part of what just happened there, the little blue veiny thing. Heck, I didn't realize it was going to be vines or roots. Or usually roots aren't glowing yellow. Heck, it looks more like lava roots or something, but okay. How did you heard, ma'am? No, of course she hasn't. What is what is Mullen up to? Guy's back. Everything's a mess. Hey, Jess, so what did you do now, huh? I don't know. Okay, the only thing we do is ask Mullen ourselves. Okay. We got a snazzy bed in here. I want to see what that spell is, though. Well, uh, Ball did not mess around. He just got Guy up and running, and we're good to go now. Okay. Can I use... Who has it? Let's use Halva. There you go. You know what, while we're here, before I forget... There we go. Okay, so... Where is it? Okay, enclosed. Blocks all attacks of one enemy for now. Okay, so it is just a... status spell. Dang it, I was hoping it would be like super powerful damage, but it seems like Leante does have a lot of statusy type stuff. Let's see, she has freeze for freezing action of enemies, she has poison, she has strength for sucking strength, she has digging, and let's see, cold for reducing wit, craze for confusion, gravity for immobilization, symphony for upping abilities, protect for, you know, protecting, yeah, she has a lot of status -y type stuff. Okay, fair enough. Stealing MP, which I always forget about. Okay, so what, do, what else do we have to learn for you then? We have... Okay, we're going to have your fire burner, which I think is the single target one, unfortunately. But whatever. And after that, you're pretty much good to go on your stuff. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can't find a save point, and then we'll probably be done for the moment. That was actually a longer fight against Ball than I thought. He actually put up a pretty decent fight. I wasn't expecting him to actually, you know, be competent at damaging us. Like, a lot of the bosses haven't been that dangerous. Are we back on... 
Are we back on that one ship from a while ago? Lion Lot, Mullen's Quarters. Yeah, I think I think we are. I don't remember it being called a Lion Lot, but okay. Yeah, this is where we had to escape like a while ago. A couple episodes, I think. It wasn't terribly long ago, actually. I mean, it has been for me since I've been slacking and my throat's been hurting and stuff, but this was not terribly long ago episode count-wise. Okay, upper bridge. Guy has begun to propagate with more speed than ever. We'll have to move on to our next plan. Colonel Mullen, at this rate there will be excessive collateral damage. Guy will consume a great deal of energy in order to resurrect and evolve. The only area with such energy is in this region is Zilpidone. But the Spirit Stone is gone. Now there is no way left for us to save Zilpidone. Battleship Lionclock, preparing to land. Destination? Luzette Mountain Camp. Hmm. Hey Mullen, what's all this about Fina being made a corporal? As you all know, Gaia has revived and the situation is grave. We have evacuated J Base and are now heading to the Luzette Mountain encampment to regroup. The Garla forces are now left with only one possibi possibility of victory. That is to reenact the myth. We must blow up the spirit stones that the Gaia has assimilated. We use a steam cannon made with Garlisle and Angelonian technology. That should halt Gaia's advance. But the destruction of the spirit stones cannot be done by humans. We must use a Carian power for that. Can we expect your cooperation, Corporal Fina? What does that Mullen dude up to anyway? Make a Fina a corporal. Well, he just kind of explained that, you know, only the Akarians can do stuff about it. But we do have Liete, so... Hey, maybe they wanted to make it a sister act. You know, they got Lena and Fien. They're both hot, so why not? How should I know? Where is Fina anyway? Someone said Fina had her own officers tent in the encampment up there. Maybe we could talk to Lean, too. She might do something about this corporal business. Lieutenant Lean said she would go to the TACOM Center encampment later on. Let's just go and see. Uh, is there a save point? Wait, where are we? I might as well grab this real fast, but where is... Wait, we're not... Okay, that's what I was to say. I thought I saw the ship. Hey, Joss, what are you doing? I don't want to even see that guy in Mullen's face. I don't want to waste any time. I'm going to find Fina. You're seriously not going to let me in here? Uh... You know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to be done for the moment, but I gotta find a save point. Okay, cash. That's great. Whatever this is. Life seed. Uh, let's just you take it and use it on Liette. Actually, Liette is in the party. I'm not sure what I'm thinking. I was gonna say use it on Liette later, but no, Fina's the one out of the party, not her. Alright, give Liette the seed of life. There you go. Okay, field base one, I think I said. Yeah, probably gonna be a couple enemies that went out of here. Okay, if we can find a save point, that'd be great. There you go. Okay. <laughs> So we tried to beat up Ball. It didn't work out terribly great since Guy got resurrected anyways. Next episode, we're going to figure out where Fina ran off to. So guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night.